Spencer is here for InsideTrackNews.com. We're here at Oshweekin Speedway. We're dirt tracking it for the first time this year. Car number 18X in the 602 Crate Sprint Car Division. It's Davey Bowden. Davey, my man, you're moving up from the mini stock division to this Crate Sprint Cars. This is your third night out with this car, and uh, I'm sure it's been a trial and error sort of process. Tell me about the rookie season here. Yeah, it's been pretty good. We went out the first night. Uh, didn't really have, we had a lot of problems with it. We were just firing it off for the first time. We didn't get it pushed off and fired, so we loaded up the oil with methanol, had to change that out, missed hot laps, missed the heat race, but got out for the future, turned 15 laps, didn't flip it, and came back with all four tires on it, so I was happy with that. Now, I know that when you were when you were sort of putting this all together, you were just kind of, you know, guessing how it was going to go, because, I mean, this, this division, there's there's not anything, anything to compare it to, and you've never been in a sprint car before, so when you came out for your initial hot lap session, uh, is it anything like you'd expected it to be or is it something totally different? Uh, I'll be 100% honest, man. I was scared, like scared, scared, scared for the first few laps. But then once I started to trust the right rear tire and learn that the car is going to drive around the corner with their foot on the gas, it was all right. But it was that initial getting over the instinct of wanting to lift and drive it like a normal car. You have to stand on it and just drive it through the turn. Now we'll look back at the mini stock division here. The mini stock pits, they're not really filling up yet. but. What's, what was, was, was once almost an exclusively Ford Mustang division, thanks to you, is now the, the Dodge Neons are sort of starting to take over. When you look back at the, the old mini stock division and you see how these Neons are, are sort of matching up against the Mustangs, is it possible that these are going to be really the, the car of the future for this, for this class here at the Big O? Uh, in my opinion, they should be the car of the future. All front wheel drives are readily available. There's lots of them around. Like all these Mustangs, like, yeah, they're good cars, but people need to start updating and like just they can't outlaw cars because they're fast or whatever. Everyone else needs to update and get with the times. Like I know it's a for fun class and this and that, but you can't hurt on the guys for going out and working on their cars, spending money on the cars and wanting to do better. And we got to really give Jeremy Hughes a shout out for bringing the Neons here. He's the guy that came out with the first Neon and just blew everybody out of the water. If he could have kept a motor underneath it, he would have won the championship. So really it was him that brought him here, not me, but uh, I drove her up and got the championship with her at least. So. <laughs> Now, a lot the, the only knock on the Neons, uh, pavement and asphalt, uh, or pardon me, pavement and dirt together is that they can't really take a beating as well as some of, the, some of these other cars. Have you found that, uh, that, that maybe people do have a point that the Neons are, are a little more brittle than, than you know, a Mustang or, or a 240? Oh, they definitely are, like with the trailing arms in the rear, like two picks and everything else. You need to change hubs and stuff on it like that. But as long as you keep up on the main inch, you won't have a problem with it. You won't be losing wheels or breaking anything in the rear end. Everything's fine. So. Yeah, and like I said, they're readily available. Parts are dirt cheap for them. It's just, to me, they're the car of the future, the front wheel drives, so. Now, Crate 602 Division, sprint cars. I mean, you got an awesome looking car here. Picked it up for, for I mean, I know this is budget racing, but the, the car looks really, really good. The schedule's starting to pick up here through the back half of the season. You got a little bit of a late start, so you're not in the championship hunt. What's the goal for uh, for 2014 for this number 18X team? Uh, the goal for the car this year, we just want to keep it in one piece. I'm planning on only running six races this year, so I still have rookie status next year. I'm gonna go for the rookie of the year next year and see what we can do for a top five in the points championship. This year's just a learning experience. Go out, feel it out, and then next year we're gonna come out and give her full bore. I know nothing else is possible with that, uh, without the support of your sponsors. Thank the folks that uh, they get this car to the racetrack. Well, I got so many to thank. I'm gonna try and remember them all here. But first of all, Liquid Chrome from Barry, uh, Milltown Tire, uh, Image Factor, Stealth Racewear, um, Woodfield Cow Company, JW Property Maintenance, uh, Milton Transmission, and Kelly's Barbershop, Bar Salary, and anybody else that I miss, I just got to thank everybody for the support. And we always like to throw the, the focus over to the social media campaigns. I know you're a big Twitter guy and uh, Facebook and all that. Where can we find you on social media? Uh, my Twitter and Instagram's at 18X Motorsports and the Facebook's is www.facebook.com slash 18X Motorsports. There you go, folks. And come on to Oshweek and come to the Big O and, and watch this dude go to work. He was a hell of a mini stock driver. I'm sure he's entertaining to watch in the, in the Crate 602 Division. Davey, all the best and uh, we'll check back in with you next time we see you, my man. Awesome. Thanks a lot. I just want to give a shout out to Glenn Steyer, too, for everything that he does here at the track and starting this class up and giving guys like me an opportunity to run this uh, sprint car. So there you go. Lot, there you go, folks. Driver number 18X cars, Davey back.